One in every five of the world's out-of-school children is in Nigeria. Even though primary education is officially free and compulsory, about 10.5 million of children aged 5 to 14 years are not in school. These statistics is from the United Nations International Children's Emergency Fund, UNICEF. The situation is even worse in the north as a result of the effect of insurgency and other economic barriers and socio-cultural norms, including practices that discourage attendance in formal education, especially for girls. States like Kanu are trying to bridge this gap, and that is why it's brought together parents, traditional rulers and community leaders to deliberate on how best to develop education, especially in rural communities. Education is no longer the business of government alone. The majority leader of the House of Representatives identifies what is required to improve the standard of education. Every important person in the society is also expected to play his own bit in the development of the educational sector. We are all beneficiaries of the educational development of our own communities. Without education, we would have not come to this level. Without education, our children as well would not have come to this level. While traditional rulers appreciate the support of government and various individuals, they advocate the need for more assistance in order to ensure that all children are educated, especially as education is free and compulsory in Kanu states. It is encouragement to the pupils to give their contribution to all the development of education in all parts and sectors of the local uh, of the education. So we pray to Allah to continue guiding us and uh, give us courage to give our support and contributions toward the development of the education in our state. As the drive to improve the standard of education in the state continues, the State Senior Secondary Schools Management Board presented a word of appreciation to some individuals for their support and contribution to the State Free and Compulsory Education Program. Idris Jubrin, Channels Television News.